old black magic has me in its spell. All right, arriving in the upper world, we see the flying fortress here. I kind of like how at first it looks like some sort of like 2D overhead shooter game, like uh, what are those? Oh, not like Gradius. I guess I can't think of a proper example, but there's plenty of those games, right? We gotta go to the sides and fight these individual cannons at the sides here. Emission, who are you doing that on? You're doing that on Bart's. Great, he's gonna learn that now. Thank you. Being that these are robotic, mechanical kind of things, they're of course weak to lightning, so I'm gonna activate Bolt 2 with Galif there. I like the background, is like we're in this mechanical area, there's a ship there. But I mean, did we get off the ship and then fight this? I'm confused. I don't uh, It doesn't 100% add up in my mind, but I don't know, maybe I'm looking too much into it. And yeah, look at that Bolt 2 sword that's doing 1700 damage, Jesus. Bam, 1500 damage. Oh, that thing's still alive? They've got a lot of health. This ought to do the trick, right, Lena? Another 400 damage about. Yeah, nice job, all right. And anyway, we learned a mission with Bart's. Look at that, we're getting more stuff. A mission with Bart's is basically like a fire spell. It targets one enemy, it does pretty damn good damage. You know, I'm really glad we got that, actually. We also got different kinds of turrets lining the, the fortress walls here. We got these rocket guys here. I believe they can also teach something to Bart's if you would kindly hit him with that. Rocket punch, why did that do anything? He's just feeling ineffective, I guess. Might as well show what a mission does there. It's like this fire attack. Bam. 200 damage. Not terrible. Oh, also, of course, we can always do Ramu. Oh, he did a missile on Bart's. Okay, I think he's learning that now. We can do Ramu, who's lightning damage on both of them. That's pretty damn good. Yeah, 900 on both of them? Hell yeah. Rocket punch. Ooh. Oh, Lena's confused. Okay. Bart's, if you could handle that real quick. I think you can hit Lena without killing her. Perfect. Missile- oh, you're just gonna do it to Lena again? Okay, hold on. I don't- I- I didn't need to attack anymore, I just need Galif to hit this thing. Here we go. Yeah, we learned Missile. Okay, Bart's is getting some blue magic stuff all of a sudden. After beating those two, there's another two over on the other side, and I believe these are exactly identical, so we already got the blue magic from them. I think we'll just focus on taking these ones out as quickly as we can. We're also getting those protect vials, those are like... I think those are his defense or something. All the little potions we've been getting are like... Neat, you know, they raise a stat in battle, which can be useful. It's just, you gotta take a whole turn just to use the potion, so I, I don't really do them all that much. Maybe I'm kind of underestimating them, I guess. Alright, nice. Got the last one of those guys, another 3 ABP. Oh, we got two from that one. So now after beating all of those extra turrets on the side... That was the last one, right? Wait, what's that? Oh boy. Suddenly from the center emerges a giant gun. Holy Jesus. It's huge! This looks like trouble. Yeah, luckily they do give us the chance to just leave. All you gotta do is go south in the screen all the way. And I'm gonna go and stay at an inn real quick, because there's no reason not to, right? I don't think where we fly up makes a difference. It's just that one screen we go up on. I don't think there's any, like, secret areas in the upper world or anything like that. Like, we could be all the way over by the ancient library here and do it. And then we'd probably end up in about the same area, I'd reckon. Yep, still just right in front of the ship here. That's the whole area there is to it. It's so, alright, we got ourselves a giant gun. Let's go deal with it. Alright, starting off, filing multi-surge beam... Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, the gimmick with this is that there's actually two extra missile launchers on this that we gotta keep an eye out for. We want to destroy those as quickly as possible, because that's gonna be the extra attacks they're doing. So, Bards, why don't you do an emission from them right quick? Yo, oh my god, Bards. Targeting those extra guns is a bit of a hassle, I'll admit. I think what's really gonna help... Oh, do Ramu. Looks like we got one of them already. And zap. Nice. You'll notice that Bart's and Leto have been hit with the aging effect. Oh, it looks like Galif is as well now. Shit. Um, that is gonna mean they're doing less and less damage over time, which is really unfortunate. Oh my god, I can't target the other gun for Christ's sake. Uh, use the mission on it. There we go. You gotta get back to target it? My god, it's, it's rather confusing, I'll say. Oh, Bart's is hit again. Shoot. Alright, keep the damage going. Lena, it's gonna get less and less damage over time because we're aging. Hey, blew them up though. Nice. Anti-shock, anti-flash shield on. Interesting. So you notice, yeah, our damage is getting worse and worse as time goes by because of the aging effect. So I'm gonna undo the aging effect, at least on Gala for now. Can heal him up there. And so now... Okay, it's still a little less damage. That might have taken a full effect. Oh boy. The Surge Beam. That's gonna do a big chunk of health on everyone. Oh, Jesus. It's also draining us slowly. Bart's is down. That's not surprising. Okay. 
Keep it going, Lena. Oh, the damage is like nothing now. We've been old for too long. Alright, Galif is still keeping the good damage going though, that's that's what I'm counting on. Bring back Bart's, why not? Now that we've gotten rid of those two miniguns, that all he's really doing is charging up that big screen nuke attack that just hit us. So we just gotta make sure we're in good health for that. Here's level 128. As soon as it says fire, that's when we gotta be worried. Another bolt sword attack. Here, two on everyone. Okay, this will save Bart's and it'll top Galif off. Surge beam, here it comes. Oh boy, okay, so everyone's draining health again. God, Lena. It's so sad seeing me like this. I want to heal Lena's oldness, but it's just... I, I'm busy healing everyone from the damage. You know what? Go for it. It's risky, but go for it. I, I need to save Lena from this awful of damage she's doing. So is your damage good now? Oh, I didn't repair just because it's... It's like an undone effect. Wait, that was enough? Alright. Sure. Ferris got a job level. We learned summon level 2. Nice. Dark Matter, High Potion, all right. Is that hole the entrance? It looks like it. Let's go. We're still heading on in. Oh, we gotta get off the ship. Also, I'm gonna go ahead and take this opportunity to heal everyone up just a little bit more. And yeah, suddenly we're in the Lanka ruins here. This is interesting, isn't it? This is more what you might have been expecting when we first arrived in the entrance to the airship or the teleporter that led to the entrance to the airship. It's a proper dungeon where there's like, you know, all these enemies, and I really want to get out of here purely because I'm getting back attacked. I, I always run away when I get back attacked. I never want to take the time to switch rows and do all that shit. Just get me out of here. There we go. Thank you. No, but yeah, this is a more traditional dungeon that you might have been expecting when you first arrived in the ruins. It's just kind of using that aesthetic, I guess, for proper dungeon this time. Also, we've got some invisible floors, Indiana Jones style. Look at that. We've got some gold armor here. Ooh. Galif couldn't see that it is better than the silver. It's heavier, quite a bit heavier, but you might as well go for it. Ooh, preemptive attack against these world demons, nice. Look at Lana doing damage again. It's so satisfying after you go from 60 damage at a time to 280. Got an elixir there, hell yeah. Elixir's very nice. I think we gotta go all the way around here, hold on. Some of these you can kind of tell where the invisible path begins just based on like where the grass isn't. Because you notice some of the edges are mossy. And that's your kind of sign for where you need to go. We got a whole bunch of different floors are going up and down here. Back to the third level. Now back to the fourth level? Or is this second? This is fourth level, so we went up. Now we're down here. Unless is that levels we're going down or is that levels we're going up? It's it's a little confusing. We got some toads here. Oh damn, Ferris's hit was the one that killed. Why does that keep happening this part where like the littlest bit of extra damage is all it takes? Frog song. Oh, you did that to Lena. Ah, we could get Bart's to learn that now, I'm pretty sure, as a blue mage. Which, of course, it's it's what turns people into frogs. Lena still does the double hit, even though she's a frog. That's pretty hilarious. I like that. Also, somebody learned something, but I missed it. Well, this heal is going to leave me with 10 MP with Lena. That's enough for one cure and, like, a scan. Is there a save room around here somewhere, perhaps? That would be ideal. Oh, boy, this is a lot of treasure. Oh, the T's! Okay, we know there's a trap there now. But damn, wow, they actually got me. Here we go, so we go down these stairs. There's like a whole bunch of connecting paths. Now we're here. We go up these stairs, or maybe down, it's hard to tell sometimes. We're on the fourth level. Uh, watch out for the hole. <laughs> At least we can see that one. Oh, there's a save point over there. Okay, I definitely need to go there and use like a tent or a cottage so I can get my MP back. I think that's up these stairs here. It seems that way? Yes, okay. We have three tents. How many cottages do we have, if any? Or we have one cabin. Okay, I guess we don't have any cottages yet. You know what, let's do the cabin. I need all my MP back with my healer. And so, yep, that got it all back. All 150. There's something going on over there. We got another cabin here. Hey, that made up for the one we just used. And an ether, okay. Yeah, there's some... Something going on over there. Can't quite reach it from here. We'll have to go a different way. Well, luckily we have another door just down here. So we gotta go further on. Open that up and then go down a level. And that's gonna bring us to just where we saw that commotion going on. Gonna make sure we're topped off on health. And then, hello there. It's Lena's father. Father! Grr, that thing's in my way. Father. Shut up! That monster is the guard of these ruins. It changes its weak point. Quickly, defeat it! Oh, alright, I guess we're fighting the monster here. 
That didn't take much convincing now, did it? So yeah, this thing here is going to be tough. Since it changes weaknesses, just keep attacking regularly, Galif. We're not going to do a lot of damage either way. And then emission is going to be good, of course. Let's see what we're looking at here, Ferris. Do a scan. HP. HP is unknown. It's weak against wind currently. Okay. Good to know, because I think Bart's can then try some sort of wind attack in the meantime. Use that arrow. Boram, 770. Nice. Ooh, and a dodge. Let's go. Uh, Alright, just keep everyone a little healthy. 240. Uh, I think it changed its weakness or something. Because that was m way more damage than you were doing before. Just to be sure, arrow 2. Yeah, it's doing less now. I feel like I gotta scan it every other turn of the fight. Let's see now. Now it's weak to nothing. Okay. Oh dear, alright. Galif is poisoned. Jesus. Hey, 256 damage isn't too bad though. Uh, it's level 19, so Goblin Punch. I don't think Goblin Punch will work, because aren't we level 20? Right? I think we are. Or maybe level 18. Either way, I don't think we're 19. I think we're just right out of that sweet spot. Oh, but god damn it, Galif, why do you keep missing? You know what? Uh, I'm gonna use an antidote on you with Bartz. It's not like Bartz is doing much else. 336 more. Scan it again. It might have changed weaknesses since we last scanned. Level 23 now. Oh, it's changing. Good to know. And we don't have any known weakness this time either, huh? Uh, Bards, keep doing arrow too. I, I just hope arrow doesn't heal it at any point, because there is that possibility. 217, okay, not terrible. Oh shit, that healed it, okay. It's also interesting to note it keeps changing its level. There could be a point somewhere along the way where it becomes level 5, and that would be the our time to strike with Bards. So I'm gonna keep the scans going, just to keep an eye on that. Level 24, damn it! You're like right there on the cusp of level 25. Also, a mission here uses less MP, so that's good to use at some points too. Hey, nice. The fact that... Oh, oh he's back. Archeo Avis revived. <gasps> Astounding. What life force. The power of the crystals. All right, Tycoon's butting in a bit, I guess. Oh, what does that miss? All right. See, after defeating this boss, he then just revives and comes back. He's level... <gasps> he's level 20. Oh, Bart's. Bart's, please. No, 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 no. Forget the breath wing. Forget everything. Just go over to Bart's, please. Okay, a little damage from Lena. That's good. Actually, a lot of damage. Do it, Bart's. Yeah. <laughs> oh, let's go. <laughs> nice. That was going to be like a whole other second part of the fight where he's back and he does desperation shit. Too bad, though. He just murdered him. Well done. Uh, yes. Oh. King Tycoon doesn't quite seem himself, does he? Father! Father! The crystal! Is it up ahead? We better hurry then. Go, gang, go. Into the crystal room. We gotta stop Tycoon, he's not himself. Father! Father! It's no use! Something's controlling him! I think you're right, Galif. Oh. Bart, stop! Don't! Move! Oh, they're not gonna let it happen. I'll let all four of you rest in peace. Oh boy. Suddenly another fourth meteor falls. Oof, big crash. And entering from an explosion on the side is this Kara character we saw in Galf's flashbacks. Ooh, nice. Grandpa! Grandpa, you're okay. Look at that. Your Kara. Bam, Gallus' memory has been completely restored. Nice. I love that visual they do for showing him getting his memory back, where the little thought bubble, like, is there, and then it floats away. Grandpa, I missed you. What happened with Tycoon over there? He's fine. It was only a weak bolt. Ugh. Where am I? Lena, Sarisa. Is that Sarisa? Damn, finally reunited, and it's just after being hypnotized. You're Sarisa! You're alive! Father. Father! Yeah, and then Bart's upon inspecting the crystal. No! Damn. Too late yet again, the crystal is shattered. That's the last one. Uh-oh. A red glow is emitting itself from the center of the world. That can't be good. Uh. X-Death. There he is. Galuf, I've returned! 
Uh, seems to be controlling the crystal shards around us. Crystal, become my power! Help me destroy these fools! Shit! Hey, Bart, don't swear now. Uh, Bart's? Ooh, Bart, are you alright? Oh, he's good. The crystals have shattered, and next up, Galif, is your world. Tycoon marches forward. Sarisa, Lena, and Bart's. Warriors of a different dimension. There's still more that you must do. The world mustn't be allowed to fall into void. The void, you say? Light of Earth, come to me. Bring back your spirits. Father! Don't follow me. It seems he restored power into the crystal shards that they should be. Father? Don't die. Sarisa, forgive me. I wasn't able to do anything for you. Lena. Sarisa. Unite your power, and Bart's, please, protect them. Father, please don't die. It seems it's too late and he's lost. He used the last of his power to restore these crystal shards. In the end, there was nothing we could do for him, even though we worked so hard. Oh, the crystals all go into Lena there. Spirits of heroes that rest in the peace of the crystal. We got Samurai, Dragoon, Dancer, and Chemist. Oh, what's happening? The ruins are falling? We must escape. Hurry to the airship. All right, yeah, we gotta get out of here. Oh no. Lena, let's go. We got a whole cutscene of the group running out here. That's cute. Sarisa takes the wheel. I suppose, yeah, you are used to be a captain of a pirate ship. Hang on tight. It seems that whole thing is exploding. Time to get out of there. Oh my! Quite the massive explosion, it would seem. 